Yo, it's your boy back with another video. So look, man, we got the girl who broke Andrew Tate. Ain't no way I can't even imagine a girl that could break Andrew Tate. Like not even on know got them like they right and stuff, bro. Like, I literally just can't. I can't see. It, you know what I'm saying? So we finna catch check out of the video. Say what they time out. We gonna get right to it. Y'all already know what to do. Let's get it. When I was 23. I was dating a ballerina. What the hell? I'm a ballerina of the Cambridge Ballet School in England, and I had no money. I was a fighter, but I was coming up. I didn't really have any money. And she lived far away, like an hour and a half away, but she Dang. didn't come see me, and we were good for like a year, year and a half. I okay. love this girl. And uh, she finished ballet school. She started dancing in clubs in London. She couldn't get any ballet work. She ends up doing like dancing in the, uh, not stripping, but like dancing in the club, you know. To, Basically, it's, it's almost the same thing. You just water down. But I feel you though. I feel you though. She's around all the, mo the London money every day. She's out dancing all the time. She's up late every night. She doesn't want to drive an hour and a half to come see me. None of this shit. Dang. So we're kind of falling apart a little bit. And uh, she ended up talking to someone famous, David Hay. I don't know who he is. He's a boxer. So David Hay starts texting this bitch, right? Mm. So anyway, when I finally saw her again, she was like, we had an argument. She's like, well, you know what? Well, you think you're a fighter? This guy, that guy, this guy, that guy. And I explained to her that these men are just going to use you. You're going to do it. Facts. At least get paid. Facts. And when she left the house, Tristan said, why are you telling her to fuck with the dudes? I'm like, no, I'm just understanding that in my chess position, I've lost this game. Yeah. The game is done now. Just sooner or later, she's out. All we do is argue. She's in the club every night. I'm just trying to say, before she leaves, maybe I can get a little bit of money. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's the queen sacrifice, I ain't right? gonna lie. That, that, that is pretty smart, though. I ain't gonna cap. But look, look. If you if your girl like going to the club by herself with her friends, and this it's an all-the-time thing, bro, cut off, bro. I ain't gonna cap, bro. Hell no, nah, bro. I could not have a girl that's just like going to the club. Like, it's just it's just fun. Like, what? Get out of here. Right, right. So we, we broke up three months later. That's kind of the, the analogy you have to be able to apply to life. Sometimes chicks gotta go. Sometimes they have to go to save the king. And uh, too many dudes, most of the time, men truly lose at life. It's because they attach themselves to a queen and they won't let her up. They won't mm. say No, no matter what. I promised I'm going to stick by you. This, you know, our marriage vows. No matter what, no matter what. And they just stay on that sick and shit, but she eventually leaves her best. Damn. It's, it's sad to see, but men keep doing it. I have walked away from women I loved with all my heart. And women I missed mm. for months. But I never fucking told them. Mm. I never that's why he tied G. Tight shit. Text him. I never had this fucking I was a man about it. Right. Being a man about things isn't not feeling things. It's feeling things and still acting like a man. I've had women who wouldn't comply with X to man. I told them to get the fuck out. They called my bluff and they got the fuck out. Facts. And I missed their ass badly. Facts. And I still, as a man, ignored it. In fact, you know what's funny? One of them bitches, <laughs> after two and a half years, messaged me on Instagram yesterday. Oh. <laughs> Hey, no way, boy. They seen that. They seen that boy all over it, and then was like, "Oh my God, I messed up." He did, 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 did. Nah, no, it's too late. Nah, no, that boy got done. Man, he ain't worried about you. That boy got two point five billion. Got done. Ignored. It. In fact, you know what's funny? One of them bitches, <laughs> after two and a half years, messaged me on Instagram yesterday, <laughs> <laughs> and I read her message and left it on red. Oh! Oh yeah, that's all I need. That's all I need to hear. Hey, look, and I paused it right at two, at two, two, two. That's how you know it was. It was an OG message. That boy said, and then left her unread. Hey, that's some real niggas, bro. It take a lot to leave it unread. Like a lot of people just love to reply or they feel they need to reply. Sometimes you gotta leave it unread. No cap. Yeah, yesterday was a good. I remember I read it and, I, and she was sitting there. And she was online waiting for me to reply, and I was like. She's not going to be the woman you need her to be. She has to fucking go. Facts. There's only so much truth I can speak Oh, about. okay. So I've seen this. I reacted to another video by him. And at the end of the video, it always shows this. Basically, it's saying, if you go to the description right here, sign up with your email. Like, it lets you know about stuff like that. You, see, you get, like, personal emails from him and stuff like that. Or from his team. Something like that. But look, man. Oh. Oh, stomach hurt. Oh, my stomach hurt. Oh, my stomach. If you don't know where that's from, it's Playboy Cardi. When he had, like, the money. And he was rubbing his stomach. But yeah, my stomach hurt. I ain't gonna kill. I need to do some water or something. I'm probably gonna lay down and watch the damn Joker right now. I did this. I ain't gonna kill. But look, man, y'all make sure I stay tuned. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notice, man. Y'all make sure I stay motivated. Make sure I keep doing y'all thing. I love every single one of y'all, male, female, goddamn. If you refer yourself as a frog, a goddamn, uh, a deer, a uh, goddamn, a Snorlax, something. You know what I'm saying? I just wanna let y'all know. Have a good day. Take care of yourself, and I'm gonna catch you in the next video. Make sure y'all like. Subscribe and make sure post notices on. I'm gonna catch on these later.